So we needed a really good project to present on at DEF CON for MapReduce. So uh, <laughs> we went and got 405 users complete walls from Facebook. Um, and we ran them through a few different MapReduce programs. Uh, all the users were part of a college network, so you're really looking at a target group of college kids. Uh, the date ranges were from uh, November 1st, 2004, and then we cut everything off at March 30th, 2009. So you're looking at about four years of Facebook wall posts across the entire data set. Uh, you have 227,000 unique posts in that data set, uh, about 76,000 of those posts were status updates that people had. Uh, here's a, a really cool graph. So this right here is November of 2004. That's March of 2009. And this is the number of posts per day. Uh, the red is just total posts. The green is the amount of status updates overlaid over that. So you can see the uh, giant ramp up here in August of 06, where a ton of people just joined the network, um, where Facebook introduced the ability to post statuses, didn't really catch on, and then they uh, introduced the ability to comment on people's statuses. All of a sudden, people got crazy with that. Um, this giant line here, where it breaks 600, this is really fun just trying to figure out what all these different numbers mean. Um, that we found was two days before that, Facebook released the Facebook for iPhone app. So it took two days. That's kind of what we believe this line is. It took two days to hit network saturation for all the users in our data set to grab that app. They used it for a day and then dropped off really fast. <laughs> um, so if you were to take uh, all the people on your friends list and you wanted to get the maximum amount of exposure for something, let's say you made a video of your DEF CON speech and you want the most amount of people in your Facebook friends list to see it, where would you post it? So here's the post per day, giant pie chart. So from our network, all the people that we grabbed, you can see that 49% of activity happens on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. So you probably want to post something right here uh, and ride this curve around rather than this curve. Uh, so we try to figure out exactly where we post that. Here's uh, 0 through 23 uh, hours of the day, and then you have your days of the week. So this is an hourly breakdown by day of the week of number of posts. So what you really want to ride is this giant red curve up here. So if you post it about here, you're going to ride that all the way through and grab the most amount of exposure. If you were to post something here on like Thursday at 4 p.m., you're gonna ride this curve down and miss out on all this exposure. So um, a lot of the implications of this, you're really looking at micro-marketing, knowing exactly who your target audience is, how they interact with people. Um, at ASU, they do a lot of human-computer interaction studies. What we're trying to do is human-computer-human interaction studies, so how people interact with each other on a computer. 